God damn, she is tall. I'll piggyback off of that. I love me my stallions, man. I love me my stallions. The groups will stop ranking by appearance. They aren't allowed to share what age they lost their virginity until the final reveal. I think I expected people to think that I'm into like hardcore, like stuff like that. And yeah, she likes to get choked the fuck out until she pass out and throw up. I've had a really colorful past. You look like you have demons respectfully. <laughs> I love that, that's the goal. <laughs> I think I should go in your spot. No. Her. Okay. Yes, yeah, her old ass was a thought. I already could tell. <laughs> you suck a dick under the bleaches, all of that. Yeah. Right at the front? <laughs> no, not in the front, in, the, in my front. Oh yeah, look at the walk. <laughs> Should be back here. I think you're the quiet achiever. I think so. I think yeah. He's a, yeah. So I would <laughs> say even, yeah. Her ass definitely needs to be at the back. I'm not gonna lie, she ain't get no dick. Maybe even at the front here. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Even based on appearance, I think I would actually put you ahead of me. Okay. I have a feeling that you shouldn't be that far down. Me? You should pop down somewhere in like here. Like in the middle? I don't know where to position myself. <laughs> I'd say maybe towards the middle, right over here. Okay. I don't know where to put myself, so I'm just gonna leave it, maybe? I don't know. I feel like she's very confident in the fact that she should be further up, so maybe. In the middle, in the middle at least. Put yourself where you think I'm you might fit. I just, I feel like, here, here's good. <laughs> that seemed like a regular lady, so I'm not gonna lie, she should be up there. I'm single, I haven't been in one for a little while, I'd say. I'm married, and I've been with him. Okay, yeah, she looked like she married a 30-year-old gamer. I'm not gonna lie, so I really doubt she got any penis in the long time. For eight years, <clears throat> so. Wow. wow. I haven't been married for eight years. I've been together with my husband <laughs> for eight years. Okay, I'm so she been getting dick. Married, and I've been with him four years, I guess. Yeah, I hadn't dated She him. looked like she been like, uh, like she got out of high school with her husband. Like she looked like she she looked like a good girl. Any longer than a year until I met my. Her ass looked like she been <laughs> she been in them streets, my nigga. She been fucking with the rich neighbor, the broke neighbor. She fuck with the pool boy. I know her game. My husband. I... You could you could see it in the saggy skin. Sometimes when you a thought, saggy skin leaves a little impression on you. I am in the longest relationship I've ever been in now. Uh, we've been together for around a year and a half. I want to put you ahead of me. Wait, that's the longest relationship? Oh, yeah, she definitely a thought. It ain't no way. I feel like she got some trauma. She got to have some trauma. So she probably lost her virginity at fucking 12 or some shit, my nigga. Do you guys feel like you had an adequate sexual... This is not accurate at all. Why the fuck is she have the youngest? She did not lose her virginity to the youngest. She, what, this this is a terrible list. Full education. My parents talked to me about it before. It was sh um, share with me in sixth grade. You know, in school. Did your damn parents sixth talk grade? To See, they suspected you was gonna be a thought. See, they already knew. Sex or that's did called pre-planning. Good parents. Find out from a sibling or from a peer. Or I learned about it at school and through my friends' experience. Okay, school, <laughs> yeah, that's a red flag right there. She was getting fucked in the staircase. Come on, we well, know them stories. I was around 11 or 12. My mom gave me a book about puberty and everything and was saying, if you have any questions. Okay, her ass read it through the book. Okay, yeah. She definitely lost her virginity, the oldest. Just let me know. My mom. She probably still ain't lose her virginity. Talked to me about it when I was eight, but unfortunately in middle school, I really grasped it because of the internet. Okay, she literally grasped balls. That's what she meant by grasp. We know what the fuck you mean. So. I feel like I had an adequate sexual education between school and my mom was really religious. So she was like, wait till marriage. I was really young, I guess, compared to the group. I wasn't like maybe. Okay, she a regular lady, so she probably lost her shit like 18. That's like the normal now. Probably like 18, 17, some shit like that. Maybe second grade, and one of my best friends in elementary school told me about sex, and her parents were very open with her about sex, so she like told me in graphic detail everything. And I was really uh, fascinated by it, but also. Yep, yep. That, once you're fascinated by it, that's when you start sucking dicks for fun. And. Once you go down that road, it's no stopping. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> like, if I could smell dick in your breath, that's... That's just as bad as trying meth. 
I asked my mom, I was like, you do this with dad? And she's like, yeah, once a week. And I was just like, oh, I couldn't look at my dad. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, well, based on the- Okay, she was a little bit too open. Okay, mom, <laughs> I could tell where you get the horniness from. The fact that you had like confusing mixed signals about sex, uh -huh. I would say, I don't agree with y'all's position in general, so I think you should be all the way at the end. Okay. Yes, yes. I don't Her ass was starting. I could tell. Both of y'all. You sh your, your ass needs to go to the end, too. I don't know if I'm allowed to ask this. Yeah, I was definitely agree that I was afraid, more afraid of it not meaning to them what it meant to me. I was never... Okay. By the sound of it, it sounded like she might have been older. It, she might have been older with that one. Ever, ever afraid to have sex. I wanted to have it as soon as I- Oh, she's a whore. Oh my God. Found out what it was. I think so I'm gonna like scoot it. down a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Get her ass over there. Look at the tattoos, the fucking high ass skirt. Like, what? What's going on? Did a lot of y'all grow up religious? I'm Christian. I didn't grow up Christian, but I became Christian. Um, I grew up as a dancer. Shout out to Jesus, man. So I was told something that was really triggering to my uh, OCD. In church, I was told that masturbating, um, sorry, that masturbating's wrong because it means- what, what the fuck? What? Means that your partner means less to you, and that you're like stealing pleasure from them. And it's like sad because, you know, like I've loved my partners and that's not true. So. You know, it, in a way- what the, what the fuck? Okay, yeah, she's bipolar. Uh, keep her on watch. If you don't have a partner, it's like, well, what are you supposed to do with yourself then? So it's something that I had explored previously. And um, as a Christian, I personally don't really believe that I should be doing that. So it's something that I try to avoid. Penetration is losing virginity for somebody or if- Somebody's a lesbian. Yeah, if somebody's a lesbian, then it's like if you do Oral, That's maybe not. they would say like, oh, I lost my virginity that way. Right. But I feel like it's more about the intimacy. Like you said, it's like, so how, when did you break your virginity? Where do we draw the line there? That's that, going back to what- Okay, so she, she don't be counting bodies when she don't like the person. Okay. <laughs> she gonna say she got a three body count, but your body count really 57. We, we know your game. What you were saying. And break, I love the, I heard you say that earlier, break your virginity, like, so- Yeah, break your virginity. So in Australia, we call it breaking virginity. I think breaking my virginity is more intense. So I, I feel it really fits my story. Yeah, losing isn't so hardcore. I have a question. Were what you guys fuck? Um, she is a freak. growing up? So I was definitely a partier Yo, in college. Why yeah. shorty with the blue shirt, not all the way at the back? She is built like a fucking Smurf, my nigga. The fuck? No that's offense true. to her. I kind of want to put you between uh, me and her. Okay. <laughs> um, has anybody in the group taken somebody's virginity? I know I've taken one person's virginity. I didn't like it. <laughs> I try to avoid that situation, so if someone didn't tell me that, I wouldn't know. It, uh, it this, back is, this is how you know somebody's a whore. If they take people's virginity on a regular, that, that is a whore right there. Like, you is a full-blown whore. Yeah. Relax, my nigga. In the sixth spot, Sydney. I knew it. In the fifth spot, Christine. But she is a regular, yo. She a little too regular. She might have been the fucking school thought. No cap. She got the school thought bill. Wow. Sloss. <laughs> yeah. <I'm just> <laughs> um, in the fourth spot, Stephanie. So in the third spot, Sarah. In the second spot, Nikki. What and the fuck? in the fuck? first spot, Amanda. What the <laughs> fuck? What the fuck? So what's the tale? I was 15. I the first My ones. friend wanted to lose her virginity, so she was talking to this guy, and she was like, oh, he always has this friend with him, so can you, like, come and hang out? And, like, I ended up liking him. He took his mom's van, <laughs> and we all went to the woods. I lost my virginity listening to Pretty Ricky with my friend and his friend watching us in the backseat. Hey, that's lit. So, that was, <laughs> that's what it was. <laughs> I was 16 and I really wanted to lose my virginity. 
and I found a boy who I thought was cute. We went to a homecoming together, and then we kind of snuck away and went back to his parents' house, and we did it upstairs. I was 19, okay, that's and I was shit. having a sleepover with my then guy that's best friend. So one night he told me he loved me. We were just like kissing, and I was like, I feel intuitively right about this now. And now we've been together for like a year and a half, so. I lost her oh, virginity cool. at 22. Shouts out to her, my nigga. I thought she was a whore. 22. I lost it to my current husband on our wedding night. Oh my god. And oh, we waited eight question. years to do it. Like everyone was like, oh, are you are you like pumped? Are you so excited? Like it's the night. Obviously, like pretty expressive about like, oh my gosh, really excited for the wedding. Multiple reason. One reason being able to have sex, right? I lost mine at That's 22. Not. It was from a person who I How got into a now? relationship with over a dating app. One night when we were at his place just cuddling and watching a movie, we talked about it a little bit more and I felt ready then. So I was. Okay, why the fuck she talk like she got squirrels in her pants, my nigga? She moving like Candace. I was 28 when I broke my virginity. So I'd waited my whole life for that special somebody. And it wasn't for religious reasons. Like I said, it was something that I wanted to give my partner. So I waited and um, I found out he was married. Oh, God damn. <laughs> you waited that long and he, he's married? Damn. Niggas ain't shit. <laughs> damn. Niggas is not shit. Gosh. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah, it wasn't the best experience for me. So now I have trust issues. Yeah. Um, I was 41. What the when fuck? I, uh, lost my virginity to the man that I'm now married to. I'm 45. So I, I She's not a bad looking old lady. Why the fuck it took her so long to lose her virginity? Um, <laughs> I hit now. Shit. Really 